a go and this is the results that we've had so far with smart agro we try to put simple ideas um, in agriculture into practice so that every farmer every serious farmer irrespective of your educational level anything you can easily go into farming with ease with our simple innovative ideas so if you want to do cassava on commercial base and you have few cassava stems or cuttings don't worry just
Hello viewers, this is Smart Agro Innovation, your channel that gives smart ideas in the field of agriculture. Today we are still on episode of cassava multiplication. Today is the third episode. So far, so good. If you've been following us, you will see that we presented on how we started the whole process representing episode one and the episode two, which was the seven day result where germination had begun already. Now we are on the 21st day and this is how our cassava is doing. Our cassava seedlings are doing. In fact, it's really amazing. We started the whole process and this is how amazingly they are responding to growth. You can see that we divided the various cuttings of the um, cassava, of which I can show you. Yeah, it was just like this. And then we did our divisions. If you watch the early episode, you see that in episode one, we planted the whole thing. In episode two, which was after seven days, and this is episode 3, 21 days. So this is cassava, cassava uh, cuttings multiplication. It's really amazing seeing that getting some few cassava uh, stems or cuttings, you can get a lot of seedlings from it. You can see how they are growing. Only 21 days and they are due already for um, transplanting. Let us see how the root is growing. Uh, let's do this, see this one. Yeah. So this is how the whole thing is growing. Yeah, you can see because it's a rooting plant where we get um, the cassava uh, root itself. Now, once it reaches this stage, root has formed. It is just in the sawdust. So it's up to us to just remove it and then we take them to the field. You see, with few cuttings of cassava, you can get a lot through our multiplication, you see, methods. So the root has formed. Still others are still in the substrate. And this is the six month variety. I told you we are going to reduce its growth rate to five months or four months where it will be ready for harvesting. So this is the pre the, the nursery stage and this is how our cassava is responding you know we started this only 21 days ago and this is the results that we've had so far with smart agro we try to put simple ideas um, in agriculture into practice so that every farmer every serious farmer irrespective of your educational level anything you can easily go into farming with ease with our simple innovative ideas so if you want to do cassava on commercial base and you have few cassava stems or cuttings don't worry just follow uh episode one two three and upwards just follow our methods of cassava multiplication they look so nice very green and healthy of which very soon once we are done with our field we shall carry all of them to the field for planting so if we tell you cassava can easily be multiplied then i want you to understand we are not only into plantains we do a lot of vegetative propagation i told you when it comes to vegetative propagation um it is nowhere but smart agro innovation 
we will let you understand everything in the field of agriculture and this is how it's all go with cassava cuttings multiplication yes if today is your first day of watching us please kindly subscribe to our channel and send to farmer friends so that they can also share with a lot of people and that will help promote the work the various stages of this growth has been summarized earlier and this is the 21 days um development of uh cassava seedlings so they are just 21 days old and this is how they look like so once it reaches this stage they are good to go you can transplant them to the main field but because our field is not ready we shall do our transplanting in 30 days time yeah thank you very much for watching this is smart agro innovation channel